Hello everyone, I'm you too, and welcome back to Paper Mario! Yay! Alright, so we just defeated a little Koopa there. And we'll continue on down Koopa Way until we can reach uh, Koopa Village. There's apparently something's there that we need to do. I thought there was a secret here somewhere, like a secret block. I can't remember though. I am crazy. Alright. Might be in a different area, I'm thinking of. Koopas like to live around the pleasant path because there's plenty of water for them to lounge in. The village is down this way. If you want to go to Koopa Bros Fortress, we should take the upper path and just keep going straight. Go down Koopa Bros Fortress, Koopa Village. Okay. Oh, this thing. <laughs> I remember this thing. <laughs> That's all it does. <laughs> Honey syrup. All right, let's go to Cooper Village first. Actually, I, I'm kind of curious. Let's, let's. I want to see how far you can get into Cooper Bros Fortress before I like basically says, "Yeah, I need to go to Cooper Village." If we continue along this path, we should reach Cooper Bros Fortress. Many Koopas and paratroopers live around here. If they're loyal to Bowser, they'll definitely attack us. Oopsie. Ah, terrible timing there for some reason. I think I'm like used to like Super Mario RPG's timing, it's just like a little bit before it hits you. This is like right when it hits you, so. Tree alive, Mario. Yours truly, the Koopa Bros. Yo! Okay, so yeah. <laughs> Stops you pretty early, actually. I got hurt, so I need. Two more, please. Badge 2. Or B, rather. Sorry. Now, remember, these are free, so you can equip as many as you want. These just kind of make little silly noises whenever attacking. <laughs> can it be? Are you Mario? Welcome to Pikachu Village! I wish I could really welcome you, but we're in big trouble, huh? Can't you see what kind of madness is going on? Yeah, this village is up and up for because of the fuzzies. No, you, you do know what fuzzies are like, don't you, Mario? Uh, they look like this. I mean, guys, they're, they're really naughty. Ugh! No, no, stupid fuzzy, get back here with my shell! It's Koopa Village. Big surprise, Koopas live here. Recently, it seems like some Bobombs have moved here, too. They must have run away from the fortress, huh? Oh, thank you, Mario. I owe you one. I, I just can't walk around without my shell on. Talk about embarrassing. Mario, be sure to keep your shell safe from fuzzies, alright? Oops, you don't have one. Uh, well, watch your overalls. Koopa Trips from Santa Koopa Village. He likes the welcome wagon. 
He's like, he's like the welcome wagon. He seems to be pretty jolly, Koopa Troopa. Just look at his face. I guess. <laughs> what right turn? Is it all imagination, or did Koopa Troopas used to walk around on four legs? I guess that was really long ago, time, time ago, huh? Oh, there's the sound effect. <laughs> Oh, you're the best. Thank you very much. Oh, yes, I'm much more comfy inside my shell. Without it, I feel very... Every little breeze. Curse those stupid fuzzies. They'll put my shell in the tree. How can I be so mean for no reason? That was my best shell. <laughs> Thanks, Mario. Uh, this shell was made to order. That's why it fits me so well. I mean, how cool will I look? I know you can hit these guys, but they're a little tough to hit because they have to bounce all over the damn place. But if you, like, wait for them to come back to a certain point, you can hit them. I think the only benefit of hitting these guys is just they have to give you a coin, but... Yeah. I got them all. Dizzy, bolt rooms, all kinds of stuff. I'm gonna check some of these things in because I'm getting kind of full. Let's check the dry room in because that's pretty useless. It only heals one HP, but it's useful for like ingredients and stuff. Same with the Koopa Leaf. Uh, I'll actually try to use some of these things. Honey syrup would go too. So that should be. Let's do one mushroom. We want spa enough space to at least pick up some stuff, so. Oh, hello. This Koopa Trooper obviously loves the radio. He always listens to it. He used to prefer music to the news reports. Who wouldn't? I like music too. How about you, Mario? Supposedly, these bombs recently ran away from Koopa Bros Fortress. Of course, things aren't much better here in the village. The fuzzies are running wild. Poor little bombs. Huh? Me? I don't leave my house because I couldn't bear if the fuzzies made a fool of me. They'd probably take my shell and play with it. I know I don't look cool without my shell. Nope. No thank you. I'd rather just stay here and listen to my music. Golden OD stations. Information station. News flash. Fuzzies are running rampant in Koopa Village. Officials advise extra, extra caution when traveling in and out around the village. He's a bob -omb. He's from inside the walls of Cooper Rose Fortress. Even if he explodes, you'll be fine as long as you stay a good distance away. You'll never know when these bob -omb might go off. We're the bombs. We just ran away from the Koopa Bros Fortress. We thought we'd at least find some peace here at the village. Boy, we were wrong. The fuzzies are running wild around here. All we want is a little peace. He's a bob -omb. He used to work inside Koopa Bros Fortress. Now he lives here among the Koopa Troopas. He sometimes blows up at every inappropriate times. Not that it's much of a big deal, but somebody might get mad. Oh. You must listen. The Koopa Bros in the fortress works us too hard. As long as they're concerned, laborers have no rights. I will never ever go back to work in such a terrible place. Skip a shave. The House of the Yellowish Roof is the home of the famous archaeologist and explorer Colorado. Colorado's always running from one mysterious place to another in order to do research. He's really well respected in this field. You fussies won't beat me! Behold my power! Ah! <laughs> How was that? Superpower, wasn't it? He's a Koopa Trooper from Koopa Village. He's easygoing, but he seems to have a sense of justice, too. Sometimes the fight for justice is dangerous, you know. Goompa told me that we must always be strong inside, or else we could get hurt. I'm trying to be, my sh trying to be strong, just like this Koopa. I respect him for that. He's a Koopa Trooper from Ko Koopa Village. You know, when Koopas are in a hurry, they slide in undersides, undersides of the shells. You wouldn't see anyone else doing that around here. These guys are never in a hurry. That fuzzy took my shell! 
I ran after it, but it just laughed and taunted me. I can't remember the trick for this one. Whoa, what a world! My favorite shell, I just washed it! A fuzzy put it up there. However, get to it. Please tell me. Help some... Help somebody! He's a Koopa Troopa from Koopa Village. As you can see, most Koopa Troopas are easygoing, but a little shy. There are some exceptions, but he seems to be typical. You gotta love the easygoing types, huh, Mario? I might have known! You're so clever, Mario! I'll be careful to let anyone tour my shell ever again. He's Koopa Troopa from Koopa Village. He's pretty mellow. He doesn't even care if he's surrounded by all kinds of noise. As long as nothing interferes with his personal space, he doesn't care what's going on in town. It must be nice to have such a stress-free personality. I put a high-tech lock on my shell so the fuzzies can't take it. They'll never manage to pry it off me now. <laughs> I'm not even sure if I can get it off, to be honest. Oh my god! I released another one. Let's see if we can get this one. I honestly can't remember how you're supposed to do this one. It hasn't been that long, has it? I thought you just chase it. <laughs> oh, right, right, you gotta stick it on it. Thank you! Typical Mario style. You're just as cool as I heard you were. I can't help but think Fuzzy stole my shell again. I can't relax, just being outside makes me nervous. I'm gonna get ya! I got him. Close. One more? Oh, that's it. Okay. Some sort of fight going on in the center one. Oh god, it's this fucking guy. This is the oldest Koopa in Koopa Village. His name is Koopa Koot. He's famous for being selfish, stingy, and impatient. He doesn't ask for things that are impossible, but you can bet the task will be hard and time-consuming. What the world's coming to when a Koopa can't even step outside the fear of fuzzies? I've lived many, many years, and this is the first time I've seen anything like this. Man, we'll be dealing with Koopa Koop for a fucking long time, that's for damn sure. <laughs> These fuzzies, will their mischiefs ever end? My husband is never here when he's there's trouble. My husband? Oh, his name is Colorado. You've heard of him. He claims to be a famous explorer. Who knows if it's true or not? He runs his mouth a lot. He's the wife of Colorado, who's an archaeologist and explorer. She's always worries about him. You know, I like adventure too. I can totally see my future wife being like that. Always worried about brave and barrio. <laughs> This is the bookshelf of Colorado's room. Most of the books seem to be about archaeology. There are also a few that seem somewhat less intellectual. Like what? <laughs> Enlighten us, please. Alright, let's go investigate. Who's there? I'm kinda busy right now. What? What? Could it be? Aren't you Mario? Oh, you are. My name's Cooper. Uh, I'm so excited to meet you. Uh, us meeting here has got to be a fate or something. I need a huge favor. I hope you'll help me out. This wild fuzzy took my shell, which next to my life is the most important thing I have. I can't go out without my shell, period. Way too embarrassing. The problem is the fuzzies are too fast for me to catch alone. And so if you don't mind, can't you help me get my shell back? I'm begging you. Hey, Mario. Looks like he's in a bad way. You ought to help him out. The fuzzy that took my shell is just inside my house. I'll guard the door while you grab him like, whoa. It's pretty that he's missing his shell, how embarrassing. His name is Cooper. I wonder if he'd be our friend of Lyra's if we got his shell back for him. I've got a side cover. Catch that fuzzy. Okay. York! <laughs> you better be careful. There are supposedly lots of fuzzies around that area. Usually they stay hidden, but lately they're more aggressive. Come here, little bastard. Oh, shit.
This is a fuzzy. Why do fuzzies always jump up and down? They need to chill out. Max HP 3, attack power 1. The problem with fuzzies is that their quickness. It's really tough to time their attacks. If they latch on you, watch out. They'll absorb your HP. So, hey, little bastard. York, York, come get it if you can. <laughs> York, guess where I'm hiding. It's the left tree, you dingus. As part of the forest is the Fuzzy's main stronghold. The woods would actually be quite beautiful if not for the Fuzzy's. The light's nice. Do you think Koopas do the logging around here? Oh, not bad, chump. But that was just a warm-up. Yorick, guess where I'm hiding? Just this one right here. York, York, you got me twice? But you must be luck. No, I'm serious. York, guess where I'm hiding? I think it's the right one. No, no! I give up, Uncle. Here, take this stupid shell. Cooper shell. You're too tough for me. I won't be bad anymore, I promise. Maybe. Mario, there you are! I realize I have to stand against these fuzzies. If I can't get my own shell, I'll lose my reputation. I don't even care if I have no shell on. I'm gonna show those fuzzies what's what. We already got the shell back. Oh, yes, yes! This is my shell, all right! Yo, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, you got my shell back, uh huh? You're the greatest, Mario. I owe you big time. Good to hear you're happy. Say, Mario, I have an idea. Do you happen to know Professor Colorado? Naturally, he's a Koopa who's a professor of archaeology. He's also known as an explorer. <laughs> right, well, I live next to him. I've been admiring Professor Colorado ever since I was in my egg. Uh, nothing would make me happier than traveling the world solving mysteries like he does. So, do you think you could I... Please take me with you, Mario. I'll help. Come on, let me go. What do you think, Mario? Take. Oh, yes, oh, yes, I'm on my way. Uh, I swear, I, Cooper, will follow you anywhere, even to the ends of the Earth. Cooper, join your party! Face down! Oh, they even changed the art of this. That's pretty nice. <laughs> Reach an item or switch in the distance. On the battle, you can attack an enemy on the ground with a shell toss. Or attack all enemies on the ground with power shell. When you want to switch your partner, press the key. Let's actually test that out real quick. Is it up? Yeah, it does. There we go. Oop. Okay, cool. Me or our work? I take it on my sucker. How about a fight? Bring it on, bitches. <laughs> yeah, let's finish it off with the power block. Boink! <laughs> Boop -boom. Yo, 
York. Oh, oh no. Be good, Blob. Oh, be good. Oh. Right now we can get this. HP plus badge. Alright, well, we've solved all the problems now. Let's ex let's fully explore Koopa Village. Now it's in peace. The fuzzies are gone. You know, I didn't hate them, even though they were naughty. Those fuzzies were a real pain in the shell, but it seems too quiet without them. To be honest, I wouldn't mind. They came by once in a while. Don't tell anyone I said that. Hello, welcome, young fella. I'm the elder of the Cooper Village. Folks call me Cooper Coot. Say, would you do me a favor? Oh, how very kind of you. I guess the younger generation isn't so bad after all. Well, then, young fella, I don't usually ask favors, but perhaps just one one. Could you borrow the book Cooper Letters from Colorado? I assume if you'd ask Cooper's wife, she'd lend it. If it isn't a trouble, please go there as soon as possible. You promise, young fella? Okay. The fuzzies are gone now. Whew. Tell you the truth, though, it's a bit boring here now. You're fucking welcome! <laughs> this, Mr. Colorado's a famous archaeologist from here. He hasn't been back here to his house since he went to the Dry Dry Island Desert. Mr. Colorado's wife is always worrying about him. They live in that house over there with the yellow roof. Oh, little Cooper is going on a morning's adventure? How cute! Take care! Oh, do you need something? You're doing an errand for the Elder, are you? Mm, right, Koopa Legends. Yes, my husband owns that one. Of course he can borrow it. Don't let that old coot uh, work you too hard, okay, Mario? He's gonna do that. He's also a bit short-tempered. Well, anyway, wait here for just a moment. I'll go poke around my husband's bookshelf. I found it! You're talking about this book, right? It's all yours. It was behind the bookshelf. It's strange, that book it has all these pictures of shells and exercises, firmer shells in 30 days. Wait, what? <laughs> well, I gotta look at that. I'll have a strange book. <laughs> okay. There you go. Great Gallup Koopas, you're a lifesaver, Mario. This is just what I needed. Hee 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 hee. This show my cutting, I'd like to make a gift of this. Oh, you don't have to be so plain, young fella. Take this. You bastard. Kiwis, could you see your way of doing me another favor? Oh, how very kind of you. Well then, young fella, I don't need to ask for favors, but I have been sleeping poorly. I'll run a sleepy sheep to help me catch a little shut eye. You should be a shop and toe tell that sells them. Doesn't bother. Hurry up and get one, all right? You promise, young fella. I have one right here. My star is a veritable hero, Mario. I need some peace and quiet. Sweet dreams till I come. Hee 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 hee. Take this as a small thank you. Take this too. Oh, did you know there's a plane in the town? I remember it used to be around the station. It's strictly for members only, so the entrance is to rest well hidden. I bet you can find it though. Here's a silver credit. You actually play once you're inside the playroom. My heyday, I used to go there and make a lot of money, but I got tired of the hoopla. So the silver credit's yours. Good luck, make some money. <laughs> Car the Cooper could gave me, use it to play in the playroom. Okay. I swear that we're having. Hmm? I can't think of any more favors than you did at the moment. I bet I'll need one later, though. Alright, sweet. You must listen. The Cooper Bros and the Fortress worked us too hard. It was a long road, but I'm still glad I ran away. I'd rest easy if I knew those Cooper Bros had been punished. Finally, without those fuzzies, it's so peaceful here. But what good is peace for us if our friends are still stuck in jail inside the Fortress? The Cooper Bros and the Fortress used to live in this village. They left, though, because they said it wasn't exciting enough around here. Did you hear the Coopers joining your adventure, Mario? Uh, that's terrific! Come back as a hero, Cooper. Hey, did you already get, go see the owner of the village? His name is Koopa Koot, and he's looking for you. He says something about needing something from you. His house is in the far end of the village. You really should go visit him. I already did it. Alright. I think. Wait, 
can keep like getting this for Koopa Leaves if you want. Uh, let's go ahead and see. Let's talk to this guy again. Hey, can we go outside again? Because those fuzzies are gone. Stupendous, spectacular. It's time to bask in the sun. And the music on the radio, little sunshine on my shell. Does it get any better? I think he says something. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Flash. The Koopa Village Fuzzy Madness has calmed down. Oh, I thought he said something like if you change the channel, but maybe not. Alright, I think we're good here. Let's continue. Now that we have Cooper, we can actually go back a screen and get that star piece that's on the little platform. Yeah. Get out of here. So close to leveling. I went more BP. Yes, this one right here. Got it. Hey! Alright. Ugh. It's okay, I'm about to level up anyway. It fully restores you, so... BP, baby! Alright, so now we can equip um, that HP badge we got. Which, I mean, technically acts as kind of like a level up anyway, so there you go. Oh, more HP now. <laughs> oh, we need to bring. I need to bring out um, Mario because this is a new enemy. I should just try to engage him normally because I don't. I think if I jump on him, it's gonna. Okay. This is a paratrooper. No surprise here. Paratroopers are Koopa troopers with wings. Max HP four, attack power one. When you jump on them or use a power block, their wings fall off and they become normal Koopa troopers. It's easy to beat them once they're normal Koopa troopers. Give them another jump attack. I think they're pretty cool because they're way of sunglasses, but they're not that tough. Oops, I fucked it up. That's fine. I was taking a slurp. Here it is. This is what I was thinking of. Okay. It was like a hidden block thing like that. Just east of here, we can see Koopa Bros Fortress. Actually, we're probably already on the fortress grounds. That's it. That arch certainly looks like a part of it. And there's a lot of bad guys, too.
Actually, I don't have enough for a... I don't have enough for the power shell, unfortunately. Man. These guys suck. Actually, I can use Fire Flower. Let's do that. Before we continue, let me go and pop a Koopa Leaf real quick. Okay. Oh, jeez, so fast. <laughs> Jeez, I can't time crap, can I? <laughs> Koopa Bros Fortress. This used to be the ruins. It used to be ruins, but I guess the Koopa Bros rebuilt it. It looks pretty huge, huh? And solid, too. This fortress was originally built around the same time the Babombs took up residence in Pleasant Path. Alright, let's go in and crash the party. Oh! Whoa! Mario, what the? Oh, we're in the world of hurt. Mario's are here already. I gotta go tell the leader. Red Koopa! Okay, in we go. It's pretty chilly inside this fortress, isn't it? it? Must be because there's so much water inside. Look at them just like floating. <laughs> Actually, uh, let me, uh, sorry. <laughs> Gotta remember my buttons real quick. <laughs> just in case it's another one of those lines. Oh, well, I need Gooper. I mean, Goombar. <laughs> I'm never good at guessing these things. This is a bomb. bomb Bombs are pretty temperamental, and they set steaming mad. Get steaming mad when you attack them. Nice HP 3, okay. You better not jump on them when they're angry or else it'll blow up in your face. In fact, stay away entirely. Attack them from a distance with items like hammers, or you can send them other things like shells. They attack when they're angry, they'll charge and explode, so you better take care of them before they blow. This fortress stays cool all the time because it's built entirely of stone. Ba 
Sorry, I don't know what need to do that every time. It's just so catchy. <laughs> I just love it. I love the music in this game. It's so good. Huh, let's see the great Mario get any farther now. Oh, oh, uh, yeah, Mario. Oh, you uh, yeah, try it here. You'll, you'll still never find your way to this fortress. Uh, it looks like there might be some fighting here. How exciting. See ya. When they get angry, can you immediately just like one damage blows them up? I can't remember if that's a thing or not. one at a time. Alright, so let me test this. So if I tap you for one, and he taps you for one. Oh yeah, okay. Slapped out on because power bounce is freaking awesome. Wait, hammer throw. Yeah. It seems to be the central area of the fortress. This area looks extremely suspicious to me. I wonder what all these gates guard. Don't you, Mario? There are many tricky parts of this castle. I wonder who built it. It's pretty curious looking. It's a badge you can get later that allows you to freely switch out party members without wasting a turn. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be kind of dangerous, but I'm just gonna do it. Oh, jeez. Okay, I can't block crap. <laughs> it's fine. Everything's fine. Oh no! Oh, my controller died. Oh, no wonder I wasn't blocking. <laughs> that might that might contribute to that a little bit.
I'm gonna control it to die just turns off because I don't know. I mean, the Bluetooth receiver is right there. I don't know how it like loses connection sometimes, but when it does, it does it like an opportune time. <laughs> Looks like they turned this large chamber to a prison cell. We can't talk to these bombs yet. That pink bomb is special. You like that fuck? <laughs> seems strange to keep so much water in the building. I think it's here to keep the bombs from burning the place down, or maybe it's just for Coops to bathe in. I mean, it's nice that it keeps the place so cool, but I'm still suspicious. Alright, well, let's keep moving, huh? Turn that damn badge off. <laughs> it's such an obnoxious sound. Job me. Got up upon the stream slab slam. Yay. Oh. So weird. These fire bars are a menace. They're hot to the touch. They'll hurt you if you touch them. Somebody said there's a way to destroy them. I think we do that. I actually know how to do it. So whenever you jump one of these things, uh, it gets faster and faster. It explodes in coins. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, this is perfect, I think. Whoa, looks like Mario's here. This place is pretty huge. Before the Cooper Bros came here, this place used to be filled with bombs. I don't think the bombs built it, but they became scaretakers. Of course, they explode all the time, so you can see why there are so many cracked walls. Actually, yeah, let's go ahead and stop there for now, guys, okay? We'll pick this back up and we'll complete Koopa's Bros. Fortress and move on with the adventure. Thank you all for joining. I love you and I'll see you guys next time, okay? Goodbye. See ya.